Okay, so I have my Samsung Galaxy S7 here. And as you guys know, this is a has an IP rating of 68. So I wanted to put this to the test. I basically want to do a two hour test. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dunk it in here and I'm gonna leave it here for two hours. And okay, as it's in here, I really can't do anything at this point. Okay, I really can't even do anything. Let me see if the uh, always on display comes on here. Okay, it does come on. So it's 12 o'clock right now, 12.01. I'm gonna come back at um, 2 a.m. Make sure that this is um, still on. I am confident because I did use the, um, if you're familiar with the Samsung Galaxy S5, it is, uh, it's actually IP67 rating. So, and this is a uh, IP68 rating. So according to Samsung, you can dump this under uh, depth of water up to like uh, 1.5 meters, which is about five feet for up to 30 minutes. And with the the S5, it was um, IP67, so they claimed uh, up to one meter for uh, up to 30 minutes. But I can tell you, I brought this phone uh, to Bangkok and I went snorkeling in salt water up to like eight feet of water and I never had an issue, I went swimming took pictures, photos with this, with this S5 many, many times, never had an issue, so I'm quite confident on this um, this uh, S7. I'll put a link below where I went snorkeling with my uh, S5. And I did have a Sony Xperia Z3 that was uh, waterproof. And unfortunately, that one died on me uh, as soon as I dunked it in the swimming pool. And I no longer have that phone, but I'll put a link below where you actually get to see the phone um, die uh, right in my hands. So I'll come back at 2 a.m. and we'll see if this is uh, still up and running. And like I said, I'm pretty confident. Okay, so it's been well over two hours. It's 2.24. Actually, almost two and a half hours. And the phone looks perfectly fine here. Now, there's one thing that I wanted to mention when I first, uh, beginning of the video, I mentioned how I wasn't able to swipe when it was in the water like this. The thing is, if you guys are going in the water, what you're gonna be using it for is basically to take pictures and like um, uh, record videos. And what you can do is if you set the, um, your, if you go into your settings and you, you can set the home home button to double tap and the um, camera will come on. So if I double tap the home button, one, one, two, the camera automatically comes on here. And then I don't have to actually click the actual camera button. I can hit the volume up or down volume rocker to take photos, just like this. And even if I'm like recording a video, I mean, you're still able to record the video and um, take snapshots as well. And if I wanted to stop the video, I can just click the home button one time. And there you go. And the video is saved as well as all the photos. And I do want to make a, um, a note like this test basically I think it pretty much confirms if you ever like drop your phone like in a toilet even even if you leave it there for a while and especially if you um, uh, put your phone through the washing machine by accident so yeah everything is perfectly fine on here so I guess that's uh, pretty much it any questions or anything uh, just comment below if you guys subscribe sub like that'd be awesome thanks bye